take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. In the human body, theobromine is, at most, a mild stimulant, acting similar to caffeine. Theobromine is also a vasodilator, meaning it can open up your blood vessels and cause your blood pressure to drop. And, yes, at high enough levels theobromine can actually be toxic to humans, and at much lower levels in dogs. Make your mark, take our lead. Theobromine generally occurs in higher quantities in dark chocolate than in milk chocolate due to the cacao content typically being higher in a dark chocolate versus a milk chocolate, but in either case its chemical makeup is quite similar to caffeine. Make your mark, take our lead. Theobromine is considered toxic at 1,000 mg of theobromine per kilogram of body weight. If the average woman weighs 168.5 pounds, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, she would need to eat 76,000 mg of theobromine to reach a lethal dose. Take our lead. The amount of theobromine found in chocolate is small enough that chocolate can, in general, be safely consumed by humans. At doses of 0.8 to 1.5 grams per day, 50 to 100 grams cocoa, sweating, trembling and severe headaches were noted, with limited mood effects found at 250 milligrams per day. Let's help you make your mark. The inventive method for removing theobromine and caffeine from cocoa beans by extracting crushed cocoa beans with water at elevated temperatures and removal of the extraction filtrate is characterized in that the crushed cocoa beans with the water first at temperatures of around 45 to 55 degrees Celsius and then extracted several. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.